Okay, Ted, this video is for you. Uh, have your little deuce here. Uh, so I'll just show you the video working and show it hovering, and then I'll show you uh, how or where you bind it. So, okay, it's already bound to my radio. I got it on, so we'll just plug in. We'll turn this on. There's your video. Looks good. All right. Here we go. It flies really, really nice. It's just so light. And on 3S, it, it kind of depends on what props and uh, what cells you want to use. So, you know, 3S with the 65 millimeter props is so awesome. That's what I like the most. And I tuned it to that and it's it likes that. Um, but you could throw some 3 inch props on here on 2S or whatever, you know. So I'll send you this 3S battery. It's a race day quads. And then... Uh, uh, one of these 450s, probably this tattoo, or uh, Talon 450. Um, okay, so for binding, you have to unscrew one screw part way. So, all you gotta do is just kind of pull up on the canopy with this finger while you're unscrewing with this finger until the canopy pops up. Just like that. Then you can lift the canopy up, pull it to the side a little bit, and there you can see the bind button right there. Okay, so very easy to bind up. After you uh, bind it, you can just push the screw back in there, push down a little bit on the canopy. Make sure that it clears the USB there. That's also how you plug in the USB too, but I kind of squeeze on the sides to make it go over the USB as I'm screwing down. Screw it back down. And squeeze in on the sides a little bit right here. And you're good to go. So this has the iFlight Whoop FC. Um, it has the little, little floater, 1103, 8000 kV motors. Really nice motors. Uh, Runcam Nano 2. You got the Lollipop 3, XM Plus, and uh, Unified Pro 32 Nano. And it is set to 400 milliwatts, I believe. And I think that this is on 3.5.7, if I'm not mistaken. So there you go. Good to go. I'll get it boxed up and uh, send you over some tracking. All right, thanks.